Hello everybody, myself Pontor from Earning Acceleration and this is our third video on Adstera and in this particular video, I am going to show you how you can set up Adstera floating banner ads on your WordPress website because floating banner ads will be stuck on your website on a particular position and when people scrolls the ads will be never finished so the ad will be shown to the people for long time and how many times he stays on your websites until he close the ads by himself so the user engagement ratio will be increased your chances of getting higher cpm rate will also be increased so watch the full video in order to get the full setup about how you can set the ads that are floating banner ads on your website to set up Adster floating banner ads, at first you have to log into your Adster account and here you will see your all of the ad format that you are going to use on your website. In my previous video, I show you how you can set up banner ads and social bar ads and pop under ads on your website. So it is our task now is to set up a floating banner ads. So you can use any banner ads as a floating ad format, but I personally recommend you to use 728 into 90 ad format as a floating banner ads because this format is most suitable for floating banner ads similar to adsense floating banner ads so just copy the ad code from there and then you have to go to your wordpress site dashboard but in order to set up a floating banner ads you need a plugin wordpress plugin actually so you have to go to the plugin section and click on add new and you have to go to the add new plugin section and then here you have to search by add foxley actually the plugin name is add foxley so i will also put the plugin link in the description and this is the plugin that we are going to use to create our floating banner ads you have to click on install now and then you have to activate the plugin as i have already installed and activated the plugin this is it is showing like this just simply you have to set up your account and then you have to you will find add foxley here and you have to click on this and then just go to the add foxley new ad wizard just click on new ad wizard and it will take you to this particular page here you can create an ad for your website so if you are using google adsense you have to select these options or if you want to show any image you have to select this particular option but as we are going to set up ads terra banner ads as a floating banner ads, so you have to select the custom html or javascript setting and then here you can put any name of this ad as an example let's say i am going to put this name as sticky as it is our sticky ads and then you have to paste your html or javascript code on this block so let's say we are going to put our code that we have previously copied and then you have to go below and here you can see where you want to place the ad on your website you have to put the ad on your website on a new place you have to select the add new place and then you can see these are the available ad format for you in order to set up on your website so we are going to set this ad format as sticky banner so we have to select sticky and then we will go below and here you can see where you wants to show your sticky ads here you can see the available positions are bottom top left right top means if you select top your ad will be shown up at the top section but as we have already social bar ads on the top section so that's why i'm not going to show this ad on the top section so the floating banner ads i personally like to set up on the bottom section so just keep it bottom and they ask you to show close button or not if you select the close button no then people won't be able to close the ad but if you select the show close button yes then people will be able to close that particular ad so i would always recommend you to put this as yes because if he is not interested about this particular ad then he, sh he can easily close the ad otherwise he will get annoyed and will leave your website so just put this as yes and select the position of your floating ad format on the i would like to set it on the bottom so just click on bottom and then just go below you don't have to change anything else just click on the save and your ad format will be perfectly set up on your website and here we can see the ad is successfully inserted it will take maybe 30 seconds to one minute to show up on your website so we will wait a little bit and then we will click on the refresh button to see the ad format is appeared or not okay after a few moment refreshing the page here you can see this is our actually floating banner ads and this is the floating banner ads and if people are not interested about this ad they can click on the cross button that i showed you that should you put the close button or not and i have selected yes that's why this button is showing if i click on this our ad will be vanished so your people will not get annoyed and if he scroll let's say we are going to refresh the page again to show you 
the main benefit of using this floating banner ads is that you can see when i am scrolling the ads is stuck right there and it is not moving or it is not vanishing so the amount of time the person will be stay on your page he will see the ads at the bottom of your web page that's why the user engagement with this particular ad will be increased and the chances of getting higher cpm for this particular ad will be increased so guys that's all about setting up floating banner ads you can add any type of floating banner ads on your website not only adstera also google ads and any other ad, for ad networks ads as a floating banner ads on your website by this way so guys that's it all about today thank you